Good morning. Hello. Good morning. Hi. Hi. I want to just quickly give a couple of announcements. Uh, some of us in uh, at Avondale have been reading through this book, Trouble I've Seen Changing the Way the Church Views Racism. And we've had a day meeting uh, at Tuesdays at 1 o'clock, but if you can't make that, please come uh, Sunday evening, which is this evening, at 6 o'clock. And we are just talking through some of the concepts and trying to see the world through the way that Drew Hart presents it. Trouble I've seen changing the way the church views racism. And then also Christina is putting together a uh, ladies circle and it starts on August 16th. It'll start at 6 p.m. It'll be 90 minutes. And the first thing that they're gonna discuss is the difference between self-care and soul care. What are the similarities between self-care and soul care? So my, if we've not met before, my name is Josh Arthur. Um, I'm the lead pastor here at Avondale. Um, and this is a promotion Sunday where students go from one grade to the next or leave one section of school to move up to the, the next uh, level of school and we recognize them. We've also invited Southview elementary teachers, staff, and administrators to join us so that we may honor them, encourage them, and commit to solidarity with them in their work and the public education, growth and development of children and families in South Muncie. If you're new around Avondale Church, I wanna let you know that you are always welcome here any day of the week, any day of the week. Uh, Christina, would you stand please? Christina Dunsmore is the children's pastor. Uh, Neil, would you stand please? Neil Kring is the community and street pastor. Street pastor. Yep, street pastor. Um, we are a congregation that is interested in common mission, justice, peace, and forming or turning into like Jesus. Christine, would you come up and talk to us about kids min children's ministry? Good morning. Welcome. Thanks for making time to be here this morning. Um, this is one of what we call our Pivot Sundays, where we're all going to um, enjoy worship and fellowship together this morning. Um, over the summer, we have had our Tuesday and Thursday lunches, where we've got to meet a good handful of kids from the neighborhood, hang out with them during lunch, talk about different things in our faith or life. Um, we got to do our first movie night, which was a lot of fun. We had a good turnout for that. And moving into the school year, we will continue movie nights on the last Saturday of the month. And we're working on a computer computer class, and we hope to continue to partner with the Rock Center and the activities they have going on down there. Um, we have a bunch of kiddos here today. If you are starting kindergarten this year, I don't know if we have any starting kindergarten. Any kids starting kindergarten this year? Raise your hand. I didn't think so. What about our first graders? If you don't have a first grade, raise your hand. this year um, for school. And then just a reminder that after church today, 
We have our free lunch out here on the lawn. There'll be a dog to us and spray tattoos. We will have um, a couple people available for free haircuts in the parlor, okay? So we're gonna move into our call to worship. Oh yeah, you have the cooker? Okay, great. So the way the call to worship works is I will read the um, non-bolded lines by myself, and then the bolded lines we will read together as a congregation. Join with me. We pray for all children, for their playfulness, for their curiosity, and for their joyfulness. We pray as they go beyond the boundaries of home that they will find strong and true friendships. We pray for all young people, for the ways they test boundaries and navigate their place in the world. We pray, O oh God, that they will continue to develop and to use the gifts you have given them. Grant your wisdom and generous spirit to these youth as they commit to grow righteously in this complex world. Amen. Amen.